as we gather this morning for Morning Moments with Jesus. Over the last several months, we have enjoyed many great moments together and covered many great subjects from the Word of God. When we first started Morning Moments with Jesus back during the summer, it was right in the midst of the COVID crisis. And my prayer was that through daily morning devotions, we would be able to stay closer together, grow stronger in our faith, but also be able to take the word to the world by using your platforms and your social media to spread the word of God through devotions and meditations and time together. God is blessed so richly in these months. He's touched our hearts with His Word. He's lifted our spirits, challenged us, convicted us, but also comforted us with His Word. The basis for morning moments with Jesus was always Proverbs 8:17. It says, I love them that love me, and those that seek me early shall find me. I pray that these devotions that we've had together have been a blessing to you. I pray that in some way it's helped you grow closer to the Lord. And I also pray that you have been able to share the Word of God with someone else. But this morning, as we close out 2020, I just want to pray over the entire Morning Moments with Jesus family, our family at Sunrise Chapel, those that are well and those that are sick today, those that are fighting their own particular battles and those that are rejoicing because they've come through their battles. So please join me this morning as we pray to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ a prayer of thanksgiving and also a prayer of healing for all of those who stand in need of it this morning. Father, we lift up our voices to you and lift up our hearts in unison this morning as a family. We don't know how many is connected to this family across the, the land and across the country. But Father, we know this. You hear our hearts this morning as we pray for one another. Father, I want to thank you for every blessing you've bestowed upon your believers, upon those that love you, Father, and those that you have blessed so richly this past year. Thank you, Lord, for bringing us through a very tough year. But Father, we also pray over those today that are sick and hurting and need healing right now in the name of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ over them. We plead the word of God over every situation going on in their lives. And we ask, Lord, that the healing be swift, it be strong, and it be the type of healing that we know it can only come from you. Father, we glorify your holy name. We lift you up above our circumstances, above our issues, above our problems, even above ourselves. We lift you up high and mighty and lift it up. You are the author and finisher of our faith. You are the bright and morning star. You are the king of glory, the light of the world, the light of our life. And we love you. And Lord, no matter what 2021 holds, we know you'll be there, leading us in the path that we should go, walking beside us in the turbulent times, and following us all the days of our life. We thank you, Lord, for it's in your holy name we pray. Amen. It has been my pleasure to bring morning moments to Jesus, with Jesus to you this year. And we thank God for each and every one of you who has listened to these devotions. 
be safe, be strong, and be blessed. And Lord's will, we'll see you soon.